Their former boss walked away from the club on Tuesday to take charge of Leicester City in a switch that left a bad feeling in Glasgow. With the Northern Irishman on the cusp of recording a third successive treble with Celtic, supporters did not understand why Rodgers was willing to jump ship mid-season. And fans let their feelings be known yet again on Saturday, aiming a fresh barb at the former Liverpool boss during the Scottish Cup quarter-final at Hibs. The away supporters unveiled a banner referencing their legendary former manager Jock Stein. Cups are not won by individuals, but by men in a team who put their club before personal prestige Jock Stein, the display read. Rodgers was replaced by former boss Neil Lennon, who will remain in charge until the end of the season. The new Leicester boss, who replaced Claude Puel at the King Power Stadium, refused to rule out returning to Celtic in the future. I would be hugely, hugely disappointed if I never could go back there, he said during his first Foxes press conference. I would be incredibly disappointed if I never could, after everything that I've given. Would I work in Scotland again? Of course I would. I loved every single second of being there. When it calms down in maybe 10 years, I could maybe go back to Celtic. Rogers also took the chance to set the record straight, explaining why he decided to take the job. I had opportunities to leave, but this was too good to turn down, he said. It wasn't easy. I've got family and friends who have grown up Celtic supporters who are deeply upset, but I had to remove the emotion. Celtic are one of the biggest clubs in the world. It's not about moving to a bigger club, it's about the challenge and coming to the Premier League. If I was making the decision with my heart, I would have been at Celtic for life. It's an incredible club that I've supported all my life. But I felt it was the time to move on to my next challenge.